Uh, my name is Steve Vaccarello. I have been shooting Nikon for over 25 years. I was born and raised in Cleveland, Ohio, and have been residing here in New York City for 14 years. And um, this has been an amazing production, and I can't wait to see the final product. It was an incredible day. We did a mixture of uh, color and black and white, and we did stark, stunning, beautiful fashion stuff. Um, makeup artist Paul Ennis put some beautiful jewelry designs on some of the models, and we did this beautiful, like, tight macro stuff, and we did this very directional lighting with the speed lights and with the aid of some cinefoil to really focus in on the area of the model's face. I think it was a, one of the most dramatic parts of the day because we had this beautiful light raking across her face from the speed lights, and in the background we had a, a nice like white to outline the girl's body, so it was just the right amount of shadow and lighting to make you know, a very impactful photograph. I mean, really exciting. I have five incredible dancers here today, and um, I'm coming into this shoot actually pretty spontaneously. Um, I've photographed most of these dancers singly before many times. Um, but the interesting thing about today is I'll be able to group them up in twos and threes and also shoot, you know, doubles and triples and singles. Um, we're going to shoot portrait style on each of the dancers since they all have very beautiful, unique features. And we also brought a trampoline into the studio today. And my hopes are that they can get on the trampoline and get up into the air and we can get all this great, amazing movement and things flowing and stuff like that. The idea of the trampoline is that it will make it a little bit easier on the dancers. They won't have to like jump off of the floor. Again, I, I want to make this as easy on them as possible. So the trampoline is easy on them. They won't have to come off of the concrete floor. They can just get a couple feet up in the air and I can get the stuff that I need with the movement and the flow. The more familiar you are with your gear, the less you're going to have to focus on getting the technical aspect right. I'm all about the aesthetics of the shoot and the flow of the shoot and the artistic part of the shoot. For me, I don't want to think about all this stuff. I want to think about the person, I want to think about the lighting, and I want to think about creating that mood. Wow, that's gorgeous. I want the technical stuff to all flow naturally. So the more you're prepared in advance with all the technical aspects of the shoot, the better off you are when you can focus on your subject. The great thing about the SP series is it's a very portable flash. It could be used in the studio, but it can also be used on location. It's, and, and it's great because it's just, it can be packed up, it can be brought anywhere. It's battery operated, you don't have to have any power sources. It's got quick recycle times, it's also very powerful. The, the less I have to worry about with wires and technical stuff, the better off I am. And it's a really easy system to, to get to know and to use. So to me, all that portability and the flexibility and the different methods of being able to shape the lights with the SBs is very attractive to me. Half of the time yesterday, I did probably two or three shots with a single speed light into an umbrella. No light on the background, no other lights on the subject. Really basic pared down photography. It's a simple subject matter, simple lighting.